Let's begin a PIC application using the Tegaderm IV Advanced Securement Dressing. The application technique that will be demonstrated has been tested to offer the best catheter stabilization provided by this dressing system. Using aseptic technique, open the package. As you can see, the Tegaderm IV Advanced Securement Dressing has two reinforced notches to provide a reinforced exit site for catheter lumens and allow the dressing to be aligned horizontally or vertically as needed. The dressing also includes one large stabilization tape strip and a label tape. The transparent film has comfort adhesive technology. Prep the catheter site as dictated by your facility's protocol. Clipping here at the site may improve dressing adhesion. Shaving is not recommended. Let all preps dry completely. If preps are not allowed to dry, the dressing may not adhere as well as needed, and the patient may develop skin irritation from trapped chemicals from the wet prep. The following directions may seem different from your current technique, but we recommend this application method based on our clinical studies to determine the securement method, which provides the most resistance to dislodgement, and in other words, the strongest hold. Now peel the liner from the dressing exposing the adhesive surface. Turn the dressing over so the adhesive faces the skin. The goal of the dressing placement is to cover the wings or widest portion of the catheter hub with the soft cloth border. For the pick, hold the carrier portion of the frame and position the dressing so that the soft cloth just below the deep notch will cover the wings or widest portion of the catheter hub. Next. Apply pressure over the wings of the catheter hub and over the transparent film and stabilization border to adhere it to hub and skin. Then, if possible, wrap the soft cloth portions of the notch around the back of the hub and lumens. The adhesive technology found in these new Tegaderm IV Advanced Securement dressings will continue to build strength over the first 24 hours after initial placement. That firm pressure you apply in application is important in achieving this effect. Make sure all surfaces of dressing are pressed down onto the skin. Now begin removing the paper frame from around the dressing, pressing the soft cloth stabilization border down as you remove the frame. A large soft cloth stabilization tape and label tape are included with this dressing on the paper frame. The recommended application of the stabilization strip is also an outcome of clinical studies on catheter stabilization. Apply the notch stabilization tape strip across the soft cloth portion of the dressing over the catheter hub. The opening in of the notch on the strip should be parallel with the opening of the notch on the dressing and pointed away from the insertion site. The base of the strip can be placed level with the opening of the film window or even back from the edge a little bit. The important thing is to place a stabilization strip over the top of the dressing and catheter hub. Press gently but firmly over the tape strip. As I said earlier, this may be different from the taping techniques you are currently using. 3M's test results indicate that this taping technique offers optimal securement results for the new Tegaderm IV Advanced Securement Dressing. Apply label tape for use for documentation. For ease of dressing removal, remove stabilization tape strips first. Then separate the edges of the soft cloth tapes from under the catheter. While stabilizing the catheter, remove the dressing toward the insertion site using the low and slow technique demonstrated here. Support the catheter tubing and hub area with the other hand. 
Peeling the dressing back on itself rather than pulling up will help avoid skin trauma. A medical adhesive remover can also be used.